Hello guys, this is Mugesh. In this video, I'm going to teach you about the color grading for your videos in KineMaster. So let's get started. So in order to do this, first open your KineMaster and press the plus button and choose whatever the aspect ratio you want. So I'm going to choose my footage. In my case, I have my footage in the download folder. So I would like to choose this footage. So this is a, there is a boat in the river or a canal or a lake or something. So there is a boat. So first thing, before going to edit, I must know about the footage. What about the frame rates per second? And this video has 29 frame rates per second. If the frame rates per second is more, then the video will be more cinematic. If it's less, then it looks chobby. Okay. Then after that, you have to go to the color filter. There are a lot of color filters, free filters for free users in the basic option. For a free user, you have 38 color filters, but for a premium version, you have warm, you have cold, you have vivid, you have monochrome and you have low saturation and lot of color filters are there. For example, I would like to choose this basic option. Just click the filter. In the left side of the panel, in the bottom of the preview panel, you have a slider like this. You can, by dragging the slider, you can adjust the intensity of the effect over the video. So I would like to give somewhat values 54 and 53. Here I would like to give a simple trick. If you shoot your video in the daytime, but you would like to convert the video into nighttime, you just simply apply this effect called B37 and this is daytime and this is night time. So simple, right? So by the way, you can change the mood and change the climate of your video so easily. If you'd like to create an action, horror or intense scene, just to choose this filter B38 and just adjust the dragger and make the scene so intense. It's helpful, right? So another thing, the black and white is also there and this memories filter. And I love this B02 because this filter is especially useful for highlighting a single color in the video. You just look every color there is a blue color there is a gray color there is a green color and every color is there but if you apply this effect you, it just highlights the blue color in the video and other colors are just grayed out okay so by the way you can use these filters in a different way there is a orange teal effect there is a thermogram effect and by the by the way using these filters you can uh, minimize the workload in your short limb work Next, the important tool inside the KineMaster to grade your video is adjustment. You can adjust the brightness, contrast, saturation. Brightness is something about increasing the exposure of light or something, the amount of light. So don't uh, adjust the brightness too much, just adjust a little bit. So a little bit will be helpful for your videos to fix the lighting condition. So I think this lighting plus two is enough for my video because it's already uh, enough light is there. And next is contrast. Contrast is something about the ratio of uh, tones in ratio of colors in different tones inside the picture this frame or this video So by the way, you can adjust the contrast also. So make sure you can see the difference, right? So just adjust a little bit. So next the saturation I love this because uh, this is about the intensity of color uh, If the video has less saturation if your video has some more greenery footage like uh, you have mountains or uh, trees or some kind of uh, gardens, you can just increase the saturation a little bit so you can adjust the green color or a unique color so you can increase the intensity of light so a little bit is enough so or else you can decrease it I love vibrance because it gives a cinematic look to my video just decrease it just increase it so so good right it's zero it's good so you cannot see much difference in the video because it gives a cinematic look inside your video Next, temperature. I love this option because you can adjust the color of your video to either blue or red. By decreasing the slider, you can make your video more cinematic with the blue filter. With increasing the filter, you can see the red. It's not good, right, for this kind of videos. So I would like to choose blue. It's so cool, right? For zero, the water looks like white or a little bit gray. But when zero, it looks co so cool, right? So I want to decrease for this footage. And please don't copy these values because each value is is different for different videos next thing is highlight so you can highlight the some amount of the tones and colors inside the video so a little bit uh, i would like to lower the highlight okay then shadows shadows in the sense you know about the shadows right so it's somewhat a black color a little bit black color so i would like to just increase somewhat shadow next gain gain is something about increasing the gain means increasing the brightness it relates to the ISO of your device. So don't uh, adjust this option. Uh, otherwise you doesn't know about it properly. Next gamma, which is also something about like this. Uh, it gives a moody look, right? It's a dark moody look. So you can adjust the gamma like this. Then lift. So it's not essential for this kind of videos. The above things are enough 
to grade your video the next thing is hue if you shoot a video in a party mode then uh, it, it the party means more colorful and more joy right so you, you can adjust these things right so you can make it red or make it blue or somewhat like this so just see this video a little bit a blue color boat with a red color somewhat like this right so by the way you can adjust the hue to make your video more beautiful so i would like to make it zero because i don't like hue okay so if your video is because this is a natural video right so if your video has a party in nature or party in gender you can apply this option so it will it will definitely enhance your video more beautifully so i love this guys uh, i would like to do a comparison between the original and uh, the graded clip so let's get started so i would like to import the original clip so the final output just see the video this is the original one and this is the graded one you can see the difference right so hope this guys this advanced color grading will be definitely helpful for your video to enhance your video for a short film or any kind of things and don't forget to follow the game master facebook page sunny fmokesh bye bye